Hi everyone, this is Rishad here. Today I am going to come up with a new episode. It's story time. It's the story of the crow and snake. So let me tell you about this story. So let's start. Zoom in. Once upon a time, there lived two crows. The crows built a beautiful nest on a big banyan tree. A snake was living under the banyan tree and a female crow laid four eggs and the female crow said we have laid four eggs that means we'll have four children I'm so happy said the female crow happily the snake came out and said hmm yeah eggs for me to feast on and they both guarded the eggs and the snake said why haven't these crows gone to search for food i should wake him them up and the snake started to make the rooster sound cock a doodle do and the male crow said how long are you keeping Keep coming these eggs, dear. We must search for food. And they went to search food. And the snake saw this and climbed up the tree and ate the eggs one by one. The, when the female crow returned, she was shocked to see the eggs broken. She complained this to her husband. And a female crow said, The snake has eaten all her babies and shattered my dreams of having children. And the male crow said, Don't worry, we will save God another children and we will give birth to them. And the next day, the female crow laid some eggs and they both were guarding the eggs very carefully and with care and they both flew and the snake had a chance to eat the eggs when they both were a little careless and when the female crow returned she was surprised to see it, what happened and the female crow said, Oh God, why is this keep happening? This wicked snake is eating all our babies. What will we do now? The male crow said, Let us ask my friend, the fox. He will have a better plan. They both flew to the male crow's friend. When they reached him, the fox said, Dear friend, it's ages since we met. And the fox said again, What can I do for you? And the male crow said, What can I do for you? We are asking for some help. And the fox said, Help? Sure, I can help you. What's the problem? And the Mayor Crow narrated the whole story and the fox said it's sad that the snake has eaten all the eggs but it is easy to get rid of it and the Mayor Crow said how the fox explained the whole plan to the Mayor Crow and the Mayor Crow said thank you and both flew and the fox shouted, Don't forget to make the babies come to me for the naming ceremony. And they both reached the nest. And the next day, the male crow flew to the palace nearby. He saw the necklace and with, before the queen sees it taking its necklace, the crow took it away. The guards saw this 
and ran to catch the crow. The crow dropped the necklace in the snake's hole. And the god said, let us kill the snake and take the necklace back. And the snake came out and said, who dare give me this reward? And the gods attacked the snake and killed it. They both were watching this from the trees. And they both lived happily ever after. So the moral of the story is intelligence always wins. So today's episode ended. Hope you have fun and subscribe for more awesome videos. And bye. My video is wrapping up. Don't forget to hit the bell. Ding ding bye. And please subscribe this button if you haven't yet. And if you find this video useful, don't forget to share it with your friends. <laughs> so, bye.